Are you looking for some kick-ass anime or geeky merchandise to really flex your favourite series and style? With original art and great quality clothing at unbeatable prices? Check out pampling.com for all your merch needs and use code OPFANYT to receive a free pair of socks of your choice with every order. Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Ranking of Kings episode 18. I've got nothing to say before the start of this episode, but as always guys, like the video if you liked the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Can you just answer that right now, please? Because I would love to know. <laughs> yeah, so why are you doing this to them? In what way do you hold that most dear? Healing's gonna heal him regardless, I think. Mananjo? Why? What is the reason for- what is everybody's character motivations like? What the fuck? Oh shit, so she has kind of a separate healing spell for poison? I much prefer Hilling's hair like this, uh, as opposed to her normal kind of queenly hair look. <laughs> Dead ass Helen, I'm there with you bro. Let's go. Yes, he will, bro. Fuck yeah. That's my king right there, bro. Fuck yes. Higgy fucking better, dude. Yeah, we already knew you were going to do it. <laughs> Easy as that, bro. Easy as that. <laughs> she doesn't really care. <laughs> she doesn't really care about him. <laughs> They're like both fangirling over him. I love it. I think this, this is slowly turning into the bodgy fan club, as it should. Bro, she's such a queen in every possible way. I love her. God, this guy has to run around, run on one foot and one cuff, cut off foot. Oh my god. The Homa Kingdom. Oh. Is he seeing into? Yeah, he's seeing into his father's memories. That's so cool. Why is he showing them in this? Oh, these are like actual gods. Little bodgy. Budgie-esque, baby. Oh shit, dude. Did you mean to kill him? She saved you? What? Aww, he's so cute. Bro, that's crazy. Actual gods. It's very different to the other kingdom. Very not trusting then. Kind of a lawless uh, well, country. Oh nice, they helped them. Really bro? Wow. Money for medicine, but she could have just healed her as well. Fucking assholes, dude. After all they did for you, you wouldn't fight with them? Wow, so Homer really didn't actually commit any of this bad shit. What the fuck are you doing? What the fuck? Why? Where's your money? How about you just rob her? Why the fuck do you have to kill her? Bro, what fucking assholes, dude. So I feel bad for Mananjo now understanding her story, but like... 
I still don't get her motivation for all of this. Like, doing this to a good kingdom. Oh shit, Bodgy told him no. I got this. Shit, he really showered at him. Oh shit, is that Appius? Wait, what? <gasps> it's Desha. <laughs> He's like, he's been sprinting his art, bro. Was it Desha? Wait, so did Desha just throw the axe or spear and like, but he's not there. It's just Desper and the other guy. <laughs> I'd like to see what would happen. Good question. Please answer it. My long list of questions is forever growing of the show. Yeah, you need to sort your mans, bro. Oh, that was his spear. Oh, so it was his spear, but Desha did the lightning. Okay, I get it. What the fuck? Wait, how did he make it go through that? What? Wow. That's very impressive, actually. I don't feel like the episode's about to end. No? No, it shouldn't yet. Oh, dude. Oh, no. Bro, I swear to God, Desper better not die. This is his brother. We're getting a desperate backstory. This is not good. This is not good at all. How can you analyze something that's immortal, bro? There's no weak points. What? Bro, he's immortal. This won't kill him. This will kill you. Oh, you tell him, Oken. I'm not ready for Desper to die. You're, f you're not serious. You're not serious. Oh, shit, Bodgy. Bodgy's actually got, like, killing intent, bro. We can finally see his face. Bodgy is angry. Oh, he didn't get a vile point. Okay. Is that really going to repair his armor, including his face mask? Wow. You could see it in his eyes too. He's like fully being controlled. Why is he suddenly... Wait, what? Why is he suddenly walking towards Kage? <gasps> Not Bodgy, no! You hurt my child. Prepare to die. Please, God, no. What? Kage, what the fuck? Holy shit, dude. I was not expecting that. I needed someone to jump in there and to save the day, but... I was not expecting that. Kage's gone like monster point in this bitch. What the fuck? Wow, okay. Um, that was quite an emotional episode. Uh, it started off kind of nice, obviously, Hilling being the queen that she is, and then we get kind of the Mar Maranjo backstory to kind of see what has happened in her life, and yes, it was atrocious, so I get why she's clearly not on the right side of the present right now, but we still don't know her motivation, really, um, and kind of everybody's reasoning. We're getting closer, though, um, but then the, oh my god, the finale. I really thought Despo was going to die there, but clearly not. Um, Bodgy got stabbed. I'm not happy about that at all. It's a child. How dare you? Uh, but then Kage, like, wow. I, I really want to know what's going on there. I think Kage's kind of, he's, I think he's literally gone monster point. Like, I don't think he's likely going to be conscious doing this. That's my thoughts on it. Um, but yeah, it's going to be exciting to see what happens in the next episode. Anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.